What's up YouTube? This is 4th Star TCG and today I have an awesome video for you guys. Uh, all of the full arts and ultra rares from XY9 have leaked. Uh, it was a very awesome night of leaks last night. Uh, it was great seeing these cards all come out one by one uh, every couple of minutes or so. Or I don't want to say every couple of minutes, maybe every couple hour or so. <laughs> Uh, it did take a while for all of these to come out, but it was definitely fun seeing them. Um, normally, cards don't leak until today, Wednesday, when I'm posting this video. But uh, they did leak Tuesday night, uh, or Tuesday into Wednesday morning. Uh, some cards didn't leak until around 3 a.m., but uh, still very awesome. Still amazing to see these cards a day early, and uh, I'm going to be showing them all off to you guys in this video. So first up, we have the Gyarados and Mega Gyarados EX Full Arts right here. Uh, I'm, I'm not a big fan of the Gyarados Full Art. I think they basically just, uh, I mean, a lot of these Full Arts are very well illustrated. They're done by the same person. But, I yeah, I'm really not a big fan of the uh, Gyarados Full Art. I think they focus too much on Gyarados' head. Um, instead of focusing on the rest of Gyarados and they really just like they didn't do anything that's really special with it they just sort of stuck a shiny Gyarados in there um, they didn't do anything special with the mouth they didn't do anything really interesting with the full art it's just it's just a Gyarados um, and I, I usually like there to be something special uh, a lot of the some of the cards in here are also are sort of like just a uh, blank uh, for a full art and I'm, I'm not a big fan of that uh, there's some that I think they could have done a much better job with I am a much bigger fan of the Mega Gyarados EX full art uh, on the right here this card is just really nice I love it uh, I like it way more than the Gyarados I think it looks really nice in against the uh, blue background with the yellow highlights uh, I don't think the words take away from it too much. Uh, I, I'm still not a big fan of the words, but I, I still think that the, this card is not terrible, um, and that's basically all that you can hope for from uh, full arts these days, that they're not terrible. Um, so the Gyarados is pretty good uh, overall for the full arts. Uh, the regular arts are really not very good looking, so uh, that's that. So, I mean, they don't blow me away, but they're definitely not bad, so we'll say that. Next up, we have the Manaphy EX Full Art and the Ho-Oh EX Full Art. Uh, the Manaphy, again, it's kind of just a Manaphy that they've put on a Full Art card. The background's very nice, I do have to say that. That's a beautiful colored background, sort of with the light pink slash coral color. Uh, very, very... It's, it's a, it is a very nice full art of just Manaphy, uh, and, and I, do, I, I do like it. Uh, I wouldn't prefer to pull it over some of the other full arts in this, uh, in this set, but uh, we'll, we'll, we'll see what we get from my, from my six boxes. And of course on the right we have the beautiful Ho-Oh EX full art. Uh, it's kind of very hard to make Ho-Oh not look good in a full art. Uh, this is very similar to the older Ho-Oh EX full art. Uh, it's, 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 it's in more or less the same pose, uh, but I, I, I don't care. The old Ho-Oh full art was great. This Ho-Oh full art is great. Got a beautiful, beautiful rainbow background in there, sort of like the uh, sunlight coming from above, the golden light. Uh, it's 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 be it's fantastic. I love it. This is one of this is probably my second or third favorite full art from this set. So still an amazing card, even though they are sort of they're not very imaginative. The full arts in this set, uh, I can think of a couple like the. Uh, the Kyogre and and Groudon full arts th those were those were pretty imaginative from uh, XY5 but these are just sort of like just the Pokemon but they're, they're, they're definitely not bad and these are these are very nice cards next up we have the other mega uh, evolution from this set we have the Scizor EX and Mega Scizor EX full arts these are my favorite pair uh, 
for mega and regular full arts in a long time. This just looks amazing. The regular scissor is fantastic. This is just a um, beautiful, beautiful full art card. Uh, the artwork is perfect. I don't think that they could have picked a better illustration and the Mega Scissor EX Full Art is really, really nice as well. Uh, I'm sad that they didn't stick with the sort of theme from the regular art of Scizor crushing the letters in the uh, Mega Evolution text, but uh, still no issue. Uh, they don't cover up too much. Uh, I, I think it's interesting that they're coming from the side and sort of on their side. Uh, the letters and yeah I, I do I, I do like the Mega Scissor EX Full Art I don't think it hides too much which is awesome and of course the Scissor EX Full Art absolutely perfect I will definitely be wanting that in my collection and for the last couple full arts in the set these are these are this set was amazing uh, last night we didn't even know what the final EX would be and the final EX was revealed to be Darkrai EX. We got a new Darkrai EX and a new Darkrai EX full art, as you can see. Uh, in addition to the previously confirmed Espeon EX. So there's the full art version for Espeon EX. A lot of people were thinking we'd get Umbreon EX. We did get a Dark type EX, but it wasn't Umbreon. We got Darkrai. Uh, this Darkrai is it's beautiful. It's amazing. I love it. Uh, I don't think I like it as much as the original Darkrai EX Full Art, but I st it's, it's still amazing. It's pretty much impossible to make Darkrai look bad in a Full Art card. So uh, I'm just overjoyed to have to, uh, to see this card be printed. Uh, I, I, this is probably the perfect card to be printed for me to be really hyped up about this set. Because while the, uh, while the other full arts are really nice, they're not sort of blow your mind away. Uh, and you sort of want all of them to be blow your mind away when you're spending a lot of money on the set. But this Darkrai, uh, man, I'm, I'm, I'm so happy that I bought uh, six boxes now because I have six chances to pull this myself. And this is all I'll be going for. Um, definitely going to be going after this in a PSA 10 in both English and Japanese so that's I, I already got the black white for Darkrai in a PSA 10 English and Japanese now we got to go for this one and of course there is the Espeon EX full art as well uh, I'm not a big fan of this again I think it's sort of just an Espeon um, I think the Darkrai is a little bit more it's sort of there's a really nice background and some effects there sort of reaching up at you um, but yeah, I, I, I think the, uh, the Espeon EX is sort of just an Espeon, uh, so, that, so that is, uh, that's pretty interesting. Um, but yeah, I'm, I'm not a big fan of the Espeon, I think they could have done a better job on the full art, but uh, it, it's still definitely nice and I won't be sad if I pull one, shall we say. And last but not least, we have the Ultra Rare, the one Ultra Rare from this set. We have the Ultra Rare Gyarados, and now this looks really, really nice. Uh, I like this much more than the Ultra Rare Mewtwo's, and I like it much more than the regular Gyarados EX Full Art from this set. Uh, you can see Shiny Gyarados here with Greninja and Manaphy. Um, sort of like in a Lake of Rage setting and I think this is really nice. Uh, it's sort of like a more artistic version of a full art. You've got a defined background, uh, more defined background, and some extra Pokemon in there. So yeah, this is this is just really nice. Uh, I know I yeah, I would not mind pulling this. Uh, I'd probably like some of the full arts more than this ultra rare, but uh, of course it's an ultra rare, so you'll definitely uh, be excited to pull this card. So there we go, guys. There's your highlights from this set. All of the full arts and ultra rares. Uh, if you want to see detailed pictures of the entire set, you can head over to pokebeach.com. Uh, they have a full set list with translations for all of these so you know what these cards do and all of that stuff. I myself will be putting out six boxes of openings in addition to showing you some awesome other stuff from this set, some deck sleeves. Uh, deck boxes, sleeves, all that nice stuff, and that's going to be coming up very soon, maybe early next week. 
Uh, actually, maybe we'll be looking at about a week now because uh, the leaks came out so early. But yep, about early next week we'll have uh, we'll have these boxes put up. Uh, I'm sure week run collapse as always. We'll be posting openings. Uh, Jordan Japan probably posting openings. I'm sure lots of YouTubers will be posting openings for this awesome set. So you'll definitely get your fix of X and Y nine. So thank you guys very much for watching. I do hope you enjoyed seeing all of these awesome full art and ultra rare cards. Uh, please leave a like if you enjoyed this video uh, and uh, stick around. Be sure to, and I'll do my, uh, <laughs> Ooh, gotta do my uh, preview, gotta do my special outro here. Uh, <laughs> uh, thank you guys for watching. Be sure to like and subscribe and stick around for more videos.